I'm Shannon Mutchell Knaus, and we're at Wayward Springs, uh, which is our small farm, and we are in the passive solar greenhouse. Uh, this uh, started construction on this in 2019, and since 2020, uh, it's been in operation, and it enables me to grow uh, plants uh, year-round, uh, staying above freezing temperatures. Um, here in South Dakota, where it gets much colder and very snowy um, in the winter time. And so that enables me to grow lots of uh, subtropical and tropical plants that uh, most folks in the area don't know about and haven't uh, had the chance to taste, uh, taste that kind of fruit. Um, so it, it uh, works uh, without using any fossil fuels, uh, propane or uh, natural gas to heat it. It does that using um, the sunlight that we get during the winter time is still substantial, uh, but it takes that sunlight energy, stores it in the soil below the structure, um, and then uses that to maintain temperatures uh, above freezing uh, throughout the winter time. I grow a lot of different things. Uh, some are starter plants, uh, trees that I sell uh, to folks online, mostly folks in areas where they can grow them outdoors. Uh, but uh, I also grow uh, some produce in here that I sell locally. Uh, one of the things that's been the most productive is the passion fruit. Uh, it's definitely not something that folks get to taste from South Dakota very often. Uh, most folks that do know what passion fruit is had it maybe on vacation in Hawaii or Southern Florida or California. Uh, so it's exciting to have that here locally. Uh, for folks. And it goes into some different uh, hot sauces that uh, commercial producers have in the area. I also have hot peppers and maybe a few more exotic fun things. Yeah, this, is, this is a cherimoya. Most folks haven't heard of a cherimoya in, in South Dakota. Uh, cherimoya was, uh, is famous for Mark Twain uh, calling it the most delicious fruit known to mankind. Um, and it, it is really delicious. I don't know that I'd quite put it there just because I know a lot of fruit and, and there are some really amazing ones out there, uh, but it is a really, really tasty fruit. And we can't get it in grocery stores here because it has a very short shelf life. <music>